Uh, name's John Wayne. Uh, I've been tattooing for about 20 years. I work and own Beasting Tattoo in Dover, Ontario, Canada. Um, something fun about me? <laughs> I love boobs. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. Very truthful. Truthful. Alright. What's, what's your favorite part about the tattoo industry? Definitely the art. I love, I love everything about art. I, I was started out as an, as an airbrush artist before I was even a tattoo artist. And I've been drawing ever since I was probably the age of five. So my dad kind of got me started into the art, the art field and doing everything with that. And they pushed. So every, every Christmas, birthday, everything was always art supplies. So I've been drawing for everybody, um, like, like my life. That's awesome. Yeah. What, a, what advice would you give to someone in the general public that doesn't know anything about the tattoo industry when they're thinking about getting tattooed? What, what do you think that they should know? Um, best off to, I mean obviously the research is going to be the most important part of it to find somebody that's going to do the proper job for you. Don't just go with somebody for the availability or the price or anything like that. And definitely don't try and change your artist into an artist that he's not. Don't try and make, uh, oh, this guy, I want him to do it because I like his color work, but I really want you to do it more like this artist. You should pick your artist and based on what they, do, and like what they do and what they're best known for. So if it's like a portrait artist, you're going to obviously want to go in for a portrait. You're not going to say, well, I really like your portraits, but I want to see you do some Celtic knot work. So try and keep that in mind, you know, that this is, this is, this is the, what the artist does and this is what they want to do. If you give them something they don't want to do, and, you know, yeah, I mean, the money is one thing, but the love's not there. Yeah. All right, is there anything else you want to add or feel strongly about or want to say about tattoos or the tattoo industry or...? Um, what you see on TV is not real. Uh, the TV shows, they're just no. shows. They're basically there for entertainment, and it's just like watching Survivor. You know, these things are just rigged. And it's all it's all an act. Um, the real artists doing it out there. I'm not saying that these guys that are doing the shows aren't real artists. They are real artists, but they're instructed to act certain ways and be certain ways. And then that's about it. You know, what I mean, when it all comes down to it, if you were to sit down in a real tattoo studio for a day, you're gonna see real tattooing and what the real life of it is. You know, like people, you know, do get emotional and cry and like that, but the most part is they're just starting to get a tattoo. Yeah. Awesome.